Hi everyone, back here in Las Vegas, B-Sport brought to you by Crosley, covering the NHRA event here in Las Vegas. Time to talk funny cars with Ron Caps. Think about this for a second. They've already raced 20 rounds of competition, race events. Only one point separates Ron Caps from his teammate, Matt Hagen, and there's two to go, counting here in Vegas. That's a lot of stress, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, Ralph, it's... Um... And not just that, J.R. Todd, Cruz Pedregon, they're not far back. And you got to remember, Pomona in two weeks is points and a half. So you could literally roll in there 100 points back and have a legitimate shot at it. So no matter what happens here, you certainly want to gain a little bit. We'd love to go with a bigger lead, but Pomona just throws a whole new wrench into it. So, um, yeah, it's, it, you know, I've known you a long time. I've been in this a long time, and I've been in this position a lot. Very lucky, but... Um, it's a dream to, you know, as a kid to, to fight for a world championship at anything. So uh, we're up for it. At this stage of the game, things that tight, any thoughts of sharing any information, teammates, that's over, right? Well, one year I, uh, in my interview somewhere, it was two races left and we were fighting for it. We just took the points lead and they asked, how was I doing? And I said, well, I got fluids coming out of both ends of me. I said, but I'm fine, right? I mean, you talk to the biggest, you know, one of my heroes, Joe Montana, and you talk about those those Super Bowls, and he talks about not sleeping. Jerry Rice, not sleeping at all, and then going out and playing like that in a Super Bowl. So there's something about the, it's not necessarily a nervousness that it's bad. I love it, and I get up for it. But I promise you, Matt Hagen's the same way, every other driver fighting for it. When it comes down, your, your stomach's in a knot. You wake up that way, you go to bed that way, you can tell yourself to relax. The biggest, Dom Perdome came up, hey kid, you got this, just relax and do your thing. He knows there's no way to do that. So you just try to, to do what got you there, I guess, more than anything. Is there one thing you turn to uh, to find that inner strength? Is there something you read, type of music you listen to? What, what gets you going? Definitely music. Um, you know, you and I have the same taste. So a lot of the, a lot of the 80s music and, and the cool thing about both you and I as well is I've gotten to have these heroes of mine that I look up to and listen to the music out to enjoy what we do and give them that backstage sort of pass. So um, music helps me tremendously. And you know, I got Montrose or I've got Mudbane or something on every run before I put my helmet on. And there's a lot of times I'm doing the burnout and I got that song in my head. Um, so that, I think that probably helps me pretty much more than anything. Well, knowing Ron Caps as he goes to the lights on Sunday, he's gonna be thinking this, <laughs> but hoping for that.